A picture perfect day. The sky so clear and the flowers in bloom. The picture lies. This is Dzerzhinsk. Life expectancy for women is 48 years, for men, 42. Once the chemical capital of the Soviet Union, now the most dioxin polluted place in Russia. Dioxins are byproducts of many of the substances that were made in Dzerzhinsk. Pesticides, chlorides, poison gas for chemical warfare. Dzerzhinsk, with its 10 chemical factories, is a killer of a city. Serafim Kreven has been living in Dzerzhinsk since 1939. At first, he didn't know about the dangers from chemical poisoning. Now he's angry. In 1994, my 40-year-old daughter died. Good doctors told me it was all connected with the chemicals here. This is the so-called White Sea, a grisly soup of chemicals just dumped, poured, left here. The leavings of the chemical business. Serafin Kreven can remember clearly when there was a large forest, pines and fir trees right here. No more. The trees were killed by the chemicals. From 1939, the chemical industry dumped everything into the White Sea, all of their waste. It is difficult to list the different chemicals there because they were all dumped together. What wasn't dumped into the sea often was thrown away, piles of chemical waste just lying around. The chemicals move with the waters, through the streams, to the rivers, into the Volga, the longest river in Europe. Those chemical-filled grasses are fed to livestock, the meat then sold to local customers. The chemicals are everywhere, in everything. In the end, God protects us. At first, the chemical dangers were kept secret. But even then, in the 60s, Dzerzhinsk was known to be dangerous to humans. Dzerzhinsk is now called an ecologically dangerous zone. <laughs> A zone in which people are still living. What's happening here is a systematic poisoning of the population through the air, the water, the soil. Genetic abnormalities are appearing. Immune system and hormonal disorders are appearing. It's not just a concern, it's a disaster, says the head doctor at Birthing Hospital number three. And nobody does anything about it, he says. From the mayor comes the charge. It's all the media saying that Dzerzhinsk is Russia's most unsafe city. To put it mildly, he says, it's a hoax. The biggest problem in Dzerzhinsk is not ecological. The biggest problem is socioeconomic. Unemployment is up 25%. Ecological activists do not ask the chemical plants be closed. They are fighting the dumping of dangerous waste. When it comes out of the factories, you can smell it, especially in the evening. The water's bad. We're used to it. And if all this isn't enough to scare you, Lev Fyodorov reels off names of other chemically polluted cities. Those only the worst of many. There are those who say no amount of money could clean up Dzerzhinsk. Others disagree. There is no disagreement about the fact that there is not enough will to deal with the problems of Dzerzhinsk. Betsy Aaron. CNN, Dzerzhinsk, Russia.